Hello guys, my name is Kenny Perkins, founder of Elite Marketing School, and we want to thank you for finding this link and clicking it and watching this presentation. No matter how you found us, we want to thank you for spending your time with us today. We appreciate you taking the time out of your day to learn more about how to grow your business, grow your website, get more um, attention on the internet. And so this lesson today is all about how to create backlinks to your site for free, absolutely free. Now, what I'm about to teach you is the steps that I had, I've taken just recently to get my brand, Elite Marketing School, out to the public. And I literally have just started this process, but I wanted to stop for a few minutes and create this lesson so you could see exactly what I'm doing um, how the results I'm getting, how I'm getting those results, the websites I'm using, the whole nine yards. I'm not going to hide anything from you because I want this to work for you as well. Um, so let's just jump right into this. So how to create backlinks to your site for free. Um, the first thing I want to talk about is the steps that I took. Okay, well, number one, I looked up the page rank for all the web 2.0 websites and blogging sites on the internet. And matter of fact, I just went and searched to find out, you know, what are the top sites? And I was looking for the sites that had a really high page rank. And I'm going to go through these steps with you first on the, on the PowerPoint. And then I'm actually going to take you and show you exactly how I did it. So I used a website called checkpagerank.net. Free. Don't have to pay for it. It's available to anybody. And I looked up. Um, once I found what the top sites were, then I looked them up on checkpagerank.net to make sure that these were uh, truly the top sites. Because I was looking for sites with a page rank of 9, 8, or 7. Okay, So what I did is once I fi figured out the sites, then the second step I took was I created a free account on each site and started a blog, or I call them mini blogs on each site that had a page rank of 9, 8, or 7. Now currently I have seven of these. Okay, These are just seven mini blogs, things that I created to help feed back to my main blog. Okay, So I'm not using these as my main blog, I'm using these as mini blogs. I'm using these as, as ways to uh, link back and, and do it organically, naturally, back to my EliteMarketingSchool.com website which is my main blog. Third step that I took was I titled each blog the same with the name Elite Marketing School because it's important. I want my brand to stay the same. You know, I have a logo, I have all that stuff created and I want it to remain, I want it to be congruent. That's a good word to use. I want it to be consistent. So when people see the name Elite Marketing School, they know exactly what they're getting. So the fourth step I took was I created an Excel spreadsheet to record the username and password information for each site, which I think is really important to you know, keep up with your information because, listen, there's a lot of things you're going to be doing online for your business. And if you don't keep track of these things, you're going to forget what you did. You may forget usernames and passwords. You may not be good at remembering the stuff. You know, I'm not real good at it myself. That's why I created an Excel spreadsheet. So I encourage you to do that. The fifth step I took was I immediately set up my profile information with a profile pic. I filled out the information that was asked in the profile. Okay. Now here's why it's important to do that. It's important to do that because you want the internet, when these search bots go out and look for your information, you want it to look like um, everything is being done organically. And so when you don't fill out your profile information, it tells Google, Yahoo, it tells these search engines that you're not really into it. You kind of have created a page, but it's just an orphan. It's sitting there with no parent. And you want your information to be categorized by the search engines. And the only way that's going to happen is if you're active on that site. So um, what I've decided to do is I've decided to limit my mini blogs to seven different sites. 
just you know the, the top ones because it's tough it's going to be hard for you to if you create more than that it's going to be hard for you to go and, and update those and keep them current um, so that's what I recommend that you do <clears throat> the sixth step that I took is I created my first post for each blog the same day I didn't wait I went ahead and my first post was real simple it was called what is elite marketing school and I had a video a very short video kind of describing what elite marketing school is and what we're about nothing complicated and I got that first post out there I published it and got it got it out there to the to the masses <clears throat> seventh step I took is I made sure to use the keywords elite marketing school in each blog post so these are the keywords I was going after because I wanted to rank for elite marketing school then the eighth thing I did is I made sure to place tags in my blog post in my back office <clears throat> now depending on how your blog is set up you may be able to do that in your back office you may be able to do that as you're creating the blog okay um, if you're using a WordPress type version blog then yes you can do that very easily because that's what I'm using I'm using a WordPress style blogging system the ninth thing I did was um, I created seven mini blogs which I've already mentioned and I linked every one of those mini blogs back to my main blog and again the magic number for me is seven that's where I'm stopping because I know if I don't I'm not going to be able to keep all those sites updated the way they should be and that's important if you want to stay at the top of the search engines if you want to you know keep keep being there organically and not having to pay for that advertising you got to keep them fresh you got to keep the current information there the tenth step I took was I decided to only sign up for sites and I've already mentioned this too with a page rank of nine eight or seven and by the way all these sites I signed up on were free I didn't pay for any of these sites uh, and the seven sites that I used are Weebly, Blogger, Live Journal, Edge of Blogs, Yola, BraveNet, and Webs. Um, note, all these sites are .com sites so when you look them up you know just put in Weebly.com. Alright so what were my results? Well, within 24 hours of creating my blogs and making my first post, I searched for the keywords Elite Marketing School. And let me go and show you right now what I found. It was simply amazing. Um, we're going to go ahead and go do that right now. Let me go to Google. I'm typing Elite Marketing School. And as you scroll down, you'll see these right here, all these at the top that say ads, these were paid for. These are companies and different companies paid for these ads to be here. But then when you go down, you'll see Elite Marketing School on Facebook. That's me. You'll see this video right here, High Traffic Academy 2.0, Elite Marketing School. That's me. Uh, my YouTube channel, Elite Marketing School. That's me. What is Elite Marketing School? Okay. And then again, Elite Marketing School, EliteMarketingSchool.com. And then there's my Yola site right here. Here's my Yola site. Check that out. Uh -huh. Elite Marketing School. Yola site. Com. So as you can tell, I have dominated. This is the first page of Google. 7.9 million um, results, and I'm dominating. I'm at the very top of all these. I've got one, two, three, four, five. I've got six. Is that six? Yeah six of the no, I'm actually number one through six I mean you can't ask for anything better than that and I'm not paying for not any of this okay I'm not paying for any of this this is all free free now let me go back and show you how to use page ranker checker let me refresh this site page ranker checker is really cool let's say you want to check the um, page rank of Weebly so all you do is you put in Weebly Dot com and you got to put in the fill in the, the uh, captcha stuff so they know that you're a real person and then you just click on check domain and what it's going to do is it's going to actually show you the page rank 
of Weebly. And as soon as it does that, I'll, t I'll go down and I'll show you. You scroll down and it shows you down here domain analysis, okay, for Weebly.com. And then you have your page rank, which is an 8 out of 10. Domain authority is 95 out of 100. That's really good. Page authority is 73 out of 100. Really good. Um, it also tells you about the external backlinks. Okay. Now this is important. You want to look for sites that have a lot of backlinks. And this site has tons of them. The other thing you want to look for is this PR quality. You want your PR quality for the sites that you're tying yourself to to be very strong. It's important. The other cool part is look at this global rank, 266, okay, and the rank in the U.S. is 180. That's really, really good. So we know this site is one of the top dogs. So you want to be part of this. You want to get one of your mini blogs set up on Weebly for sure. All right. So that's how you use checkpagerank.net. Real simple. Um, one other thing I wanted to show you, um, actually, let me go back to my, my PowerPoint before I show you that. Um, because you're probably wondering, you're probably wondering, you know, <laughs> well, you don't really talk about your main blog and what you're using. Well, let me tell you now what my real secret is here. Um, <clears throat> and the reason I talk about page rank is because it's important. You need to understand that when you have your main blog set up, it needs to be tied to something that has a lot of backlinks coming to it. Okay? So, uh, let, me, let me just show you this. Let's go check out EmpowerNetwork.com and see what their page rank is. Um, they, they come out with a with a newer um, newer version of their blogging system called Kalatu. And as you can see, they have a lot of external backlinks coming in here. We're looking at you know eight million. Um, their global rank. In the U.S. is 5,415. Okay, and we're talking about a not a huge company here. We're talking about you know a fairly small company, um, and their expertise is marketing, especially internet marketing, and their PR quality is very strong. So here's the important part. Okay, now let me just show you, um, kind of go into my into my Kalatu blog, and show you. Exactly um, what how easy this thing is to use. It's just so easy to use. Okay, as you can see here, this is my Claw 2 blog, uh, Elite Marketing School. Okay, I can visit the site if I want to, and you know, you're already on my site, so I don't need to do that. Um, <clears throat> they have a 21 day blogging challenge. If you've never blogged before, you can take this challenge, and it just kind of teaches you how to how to blog every day. Okay, because they say if you blog every day, then you'll get the results you're looking for. And that's probably true. Um, what I wanted to show you, though, is I wanted to show you, and I'm just going to click on Add New. I'm not going to do a post. But I wanted to show you how easy it is to post something. Okay, right here you put in your title. Um, down here is the, the body of your, of your message, or whatever you're trying to put out to the world, um, you know, for your post. But the thing I really want to talk about is down here is your, is your SEO, okay, your tags. Because it, keywords are important. And, you know, the three keywords I was going after was elite marketing school. So over here in my tags, I made sure to put in, you know, elite marketing school. Um, I put in elite marketing. I put in what is elite marketing school. And you can see it pop up there on my screen um, because I've already put those tags in. That is what helped drive my um, recognition up for the search engines because I was tagging my post properly. When you do post on blogs, you need to tag them properly or you're not going to get the results I got. You're not going to get these results right here. Okay, 
you have to tag your stuff. If you don't tag your stuff, you might as well just forget it. You're wasting your time. But tagging your stuff is really, really important. All right. So guys, that's really it. That is my big secret. Um, to, I mean, it's not really a secret. A lot of people already know about this. But maybe you're new. Maybe you don't know about this. Maybe um, you don't understand PageRank. Um, it's real simple. If you want a powerful blogging platform, um, a blogging system that's going to help, you know, get those natural backlinks um, for you, then just do the steps that I've given you in this lesson. Create your mini blogs, get your free accounts, do all that. But most importantly, get into this blogging platform with Kalatu and Empower Network. Here's why. Because they have already have a following, they have a lot of backlinks, they have established themselves, um, the search engines are going to love you. Plain and simple. They're going to love you. Because the track record is there. And when a track record's already been established, it's good to tie yourself to that track record. Especially if you want to move up fast, um, move up quickly in the rankings on Google. Google is the number one search engine, and the only way you're going to you're going to get to the top is to think the way Google thinks. And um, for, you know, don't worry about all these crazy algorithms and stuff they come out with because you'll never figure it out. You just never you never will. So my main thing is, is when you blog, be natural, be organic, do it every day, and put up information that's important to your blog, you know, whatever your blog is about, that's the kind of stuff you want to put on your blog. Like mine, Elite Marketing School, is all about marketing. How to get the word out. How to, um, how to do this kind of stuff, like I'm showing you, you know, step-by-step -step stuff. So, guys, if you want to get your own Kalatu blog, it's only $25 a month. That's dirt cheap. Um, you can spend a lot more than that just going out here and getting well let me just show you a quick example like on this website right here on uh, page rank checker .net, um, you can buy backlinks now I don't really recommend that but some people do that but you can buy backlinks um, let's see if there's an ad on here there's usually ads running for these things but um, but right here you can see you know buy links okay look right here PR7 backlinks for $90. $90. $90 for PR7 backlinks. Guys, you can do this yourself. Just do it organically, like I've said. Okay? Look, don't pay 90 bucks for this stuff. Get your Kalatu blog. Create your backlinks. Put your, put your mini blogs linking back to your main blog. And everything else will take care of itself. All right, so if you'll look down below, there is a link to take you to sign up for your Kalatu blog if you're interested. Um, if you're not, you're not going to hurt my feelings, and um, I'm going to continue to use this because it works. And I appreciate you stopping by. This is the Elite Marketing School. We thank you for your time, and um, hey, tell your friends about us. Get on Facebook, check us out, um, you know, like us, whatever you want to do. Uh, communicate with us. We'll be glad to answer questions that you might have about uh, anything marketing related. Um, we do have a dedicated page on Facebook, so just go find that, facebook.com backslash Elite Marketing School. We appreciate your time, and we hope you have a fantastic day. See you next time. Bye-bye.